Welcome back, everyone. Uh, today, we're going over Arrow. We're doing Season 3, Episode 6, and the episode is called A Guilty. And if you can tell, I did trim my beard. I had to go. Anyway, so, um, we start off the episode with Roy is just being very distracted, um, and he's just not really focusing his energies and stuff, so then someone, um, then, um, so they're after this this person, right? And so they get to it, and it turns out someone already been to it and literally killed everybody and spelled guilty in blood. And then, um, Oliver uh, tells Roy just to uh, take off, just take the night off. Like, if you're not focused right, I can't put you out there because it's not safe. Then we have a flashback scene where Oliver sees uh, China's wife's delivery guy, and, um, so he's chasing them all through the the market, and what happens is he, um, the guy drops the envelope, and we don't see where it is, and so he can't find it. Oh my God! Excuse us I still I'm keeping that in. Anyway, so we have a flashback scene where um I mean so we go back to the present, where Laurel is just boxing and learning all these types of moves and stuff, and then. Uh, then we cut to Roy, um, last with Felicity about, cause she asked, are you okay? Like, what's wrong? And, um, so yeah, so the, um, he says, oh, I'm fine. Don't worry about it. It's fine. Everything's great. <laughs> and then we cut to, um, um, Arrow finds Paco cause that was the next person on the list. So he finds Paco, and, but Paco's dead. And then, um. We cut to Roy finally consulting to Felicity about the dreams. And then, um, as Arrow is leaving the crime scene, we see Cupid's little intro right there. Like, we just see her just, like, at the crime scene. Then we have the flashback scene where Oliver gets annoyed with the kid. <laughs> I can't remember we got the kid's name. I want to say Kiro or something like that. Oh, Akira, something like that. Something like that. Anyway, I, I wanted to look it up after this episode. <laughs> and then, um, then we go back to the present where Arrow goes after Ted. Then it's Ted versus the Arrow. And then they, um, uh, and then we find out, um, who the person that's been doing all this stuff is on um, Ted's old partner. Because Ted used to be a vigilante as well. Named Wildcat. And then, um, then Oliver gets kind of concerned uh, about Ted and Laurel, and then Laurel gets really mad at Oliver, saying, "Like, well, you didn't, tr you d refused to train me, so I had to find my own training, and I really do like this person who's training me." So then um, they they split up, and then Ted and Eric get on close to finding a lead, and then Felicity tells Roy he might have killed Sarah because. Um, so the mirror, Trace Maker could have been in the system with like one final jolt and that's why he doesn't remember and stuff. And then, uh, we cut to where Ted gets arrested. And then, uh, well, then we cut to Roy tells the team about Sarah, how he thinks he killed her and stuff. And then Laurel gets upset and then Roy just leaves. Then we go to a flashback scene where Oliver and Katsu tried to figure out where the envelope is. And they did this little uh, mind trick with like a candle and just like clearing your mind and stuff like that. And it actually works really well. Then we go back to the present where Ted tells Laurel um, who the guy is, um, which is his partner. And the guy's name is Isaac and he murdered all those people, including the one that was on his rap sheet from like forever ago. And that's why he hung up the glove or the mask. It hung up being a vigilante. And then, um, Isaac finds Ted, and then Laurel calls uh, Felicity while they're driving, because she also got kidnapped as well, so she calls Felicity, and, she, and Felicity at first calls the butt doll, but it's not. And then Team Arrow goes after them. Then Laurel uh, just crashes the car on purpose. And then Roy, then it's Roy versus Isaac, and then Roy knocks him out. And then Arrow tells Ted to stay away from Laurel, which I don't think they do. And then Oliver helps Roy, trying to figure out like why is he dreaming, what's he's dreaming. Then um, then 
Roy finally remembers that he killed a cop when he was all cray cray in the head with Mirakuru. And then uh, Roy gets very upset about that and then he leaves. And then we have a flashback scene where they find the dead drop and unveil a message. And it's a weird message because it's like, um, like just a pretty little picture, but if you um, have it under a certain light or do something weird to it, it um, reveals what the message is. We have the present day where Ted and Laurel continue the train. And then when Cupid's being um, when Isaac is leaving the uh, to be transferred, uh, Cupid literally kills him. It's just like, Cupid's stupid and literally shoots him. And that's the end of the episode. Um, it's a really good episode, though. I really do like it how um, we're getting more on um, Laurel's training and her being um, more competent in the field because they're trying to build up to that. So I really do like that, and though I do like um, how Oliver's like, I don't want you doing that, and she's like, suck it, I'm doing it anyway. <laughs> and um, I like how um, they use the techniques and stuff that he's learned in the, in the flashback, and it was it, used it also in the current episode. I really do think that's really cool, and I really do like that a lot. And what else? I just like everything that's happening right now, so... Um, if you like this type of video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Comment down below what you think of the episode. Did you like it? Did you hate it? And subscribe for more stuff coming from me. And I forgot, I think I told y'all in another video, but I, I actually got a light. So that is not cray cray on me anymore. It's not like one half is not um, dark and one other half is not. So it's a little like this. Which I think is better. But anyway. Uh, well, I mean, I think this is better, honestly. Anyway, I'm screwing this all up. So anyway, just subscribe. I'm random. It happens. So anyway, uh, I want y'all to have a very awesome day. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye, everybody.